We're gonna bring a large pot of water to a boil. It's not full as you can see. I'm gonna add half a lemon and some peppercorns. We're just gonna let this boil. I have a bowl of ice water sitting by and now I'm going to add one and a half pounds of peeled and deveined shrimp. This is gonna cook very fast. Now that the shrimp has changed color, I'm going to drain it and put it in the ice water. We're gonna cool it down completely and we're gonna chop it and put it in a bowl. Okay, as you can see, I put this in a shallow uh, dish. I'm going to add the juice of three limes and an orange to this. I'm also gonna add some salt. I'm going to cover this and I'm going to let it sit in the fridge for about 30 minutes. All right, this has been in the fridge, as I told you, for 30 minutes. I'm going to add maybe three tablespoons of finely chopped onion. This is white onion. Use white onion because it is not super strong when, you know, when it's raw. And I'm adding half a jalapeno, which I took the membrane seeds off and chopped finely. If you can't find jalapenos, you can use any chili that you can find. And also, this is optional. All right, we're going to mix this, cover it, and let it refrigerate for another 30 minutes. Okay, let's finish this up. I'm gonna add about a cup of seeded, peeled, and finely chopped cucumber. A small tomato, which I chopped. Maybe a quarter cup of chopped cilantro. And an avocado, which I just peeled and then cut into cubes. We're just going to mix this carefully so we don't mash the avocado. We're going to taste it and adjust the salt if necessary and serve it on tostadas. This is an excellent meal for hot days. Obviously, you can make more quantity of this and you know, it'll keep for a couple days, so let's eat. Mmm, -hmm. mm. wow. This is so fresh. Oh my gosh, that shrimp is wonderful. The whole combination of vegetables and the juices, really, really nice.